What's up guys? This is Space Battle Beta X here and welcome to this week's unboxing video. <clears throat> Today I'll be unboxing a um Connor Scorpio versus Burnwolf 2 pack, which is kinda weird because since this doesn't have a name. Uh yeah, uh look taking a look at the packaging, it's a standard metal masters pack packaging but that displays the two base nicely. Connor Scorpio on on Connor Scorpio side <coughs> and Burn Wolf on the right side nothing special and on the back just double stats double stats Saturday but here you go mm. it's okay looking I don't really I'm not one for stat looking right now uh, for base so yeah uh, so yeah let's get this thing open So, before we get to the actual base, let's look at the accessories. Um, it's a standard off uh, standard packaging. So, the uh, launcher for um, Connor Scorpio is this nice goldish, dark, darkish gold color, which is really nice. But yeah, once you've seen all standard right launchers, um, Hasbro launchers, you've seen them all, so like that. Comes with a black string launcher, nothing's too special. Um, <coughs> Burn Wolf's one, uh, string launcher and ripcord combo, or launcher and com string combo, bleh, is blue. <coughs> yeah, just blue and some kind of gold greenish color, I have no idea. Yeah, storage pieces, so those are gonna go away. Um, <coughs> Their tools are, I guess, and I'm guessing Connor Scorpios is black, a black tool, which is really nice, and or uh, and Burn Wolf's. I have no idea whose one is whose. I just ripped it out. So somebody comes with a blue tool, which is okay. I already have enough tools as it is. So put that, so put that stuff to the side. Instructions that I won't use, and the sticker sheet. I. Apparently they put the stickers on wrong for Burn Wolf. That's actually out of place. But then again, I don't really use stickers <coughs> on my base anymore because it's just because they get eaten eaten away. Pretty nice though for the face vault, just a giant wolf's mouth. Um, yeah, storage in the P Pikachu mug and here's uh, Connor Scorpio stickers, which is. Again, okay looking for in my opinion. Won't use these. So yeah, let's move on to the next thing. I which is which is the codes, guys. So it's code time for anybody that plays Baby Online, and you guys get two codes for the price of one video. So you start off with Connor Scorpio's code, which is right here. Yeah. Crappy lighting. If you guys can make that out, you guys can write it down, and you guys now have Connor Scorpio online. Okay, enough of that. Let's go on to on to uh, Burn Wolf SW one four five. Oh, that's what I forgot to say. The parts numbers. Well, I'll get that later. But here's Burn Wolf's one. Seven ten. Well, I'm actually resetting the code here. Here you go. There's the code for Burn Wolf. If you guys want it, and now you, guys, whoever gets it, now has Burn Wolf also. So here you go, guys. <clears throat> Put that down. Um. So yeah, I guess get to the base. Uh, Connor Scorpio first. Nice 
black and black face belt with the green tattooed face belt, which is a uh, face sticker. Which is always nice. You guys can't see that, but that is Scorpion or Scorpio. Which is alright. Really good. Happy with that. Uh, here is what you call the Scorpio track. Pretty light. One of the was it? I think it's the second lightest. Uh clear wheel out there nice yellowish goldish color it's not actually gold but you see that's a nice yellowish orange color with the scorpion two scorpion tails uh, here we have the counter wheel this is my second counter wheel because I already have Connor Leon it's okay it's in like uh it's like a step down from the rock wheel because uh, the rock wheel is actually heavier than this. This is a pretty light wheel, a uh, pretty light wheel in my opinion. Uh, I have no idea what I'm saying right now, but really nice defensive wheel. Like I said, kind of light. <coughs> uh, up next we have the one for five track, which reminds me, like I forgot to name like the full on name, so I'm sorry for that. I'll work. On, I'll fix that next time. But yeah, here we have an, the standard one four five track for Connor Scorpio, which is a nice gold color. I think it's gold, goldish bronze. Yeah, standard one four five track, which is a fairly common track actually. So, blah. And lastly, we have the D tip, which is. Not as good as the WD, but it's still nice, nice black. Actually, I think this is my first D tip. But yeah. So let's get um, let's Connor Scorpio together. And here we have um, Connor Scorpio fully assembled um in the anime it's um owned by a demure 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 of um team wild fan which is okay but it actually has a different color scheme in the anime but i have no idea why they changed it up for the actual toy but overall looks like a decent bay um nothing too special about it just it's <laughs> just another standard bay from hasbro Overall, not bad of a color scheme. Although it's kind of all over the place again with the orange and the silver, the uh, not silver, gold track. Mm, oops. But enough of this, and let's move on to um, Burn Wolf. So, for the face belt, it is a nice. I have no idea what color this is. It's like I have <laughs> I have no idea what color is like a, light, a lighter sh shade of red with a silver wolf mouth like howling at you, which is a pretty unique face spot in my opinion. Can't even see that, but yeah, sorry. It's the the tattooed face looks silver on the red, which is kind of hard to see overall, but looks pretty nice. The uh, berry camo. And moving on to the oh, what's called clear wheel. Excuse me, I'm spacing out today. Uh, not bad looking. Uh, looks like a decent stamina wheel. Ish balance has four. I'm guessing those are four wolf heads from looking down from the tops. Which is pretty clever. It's a nice. Maroon, magenta-ish color. I'm really liking that. So moving up, yeah, yeah, decent looking wheel, clear wheel. Now we have the burn wheel. It's my second burn wheel that came. I already have. Uh, what's it called? The burn. The burn wheel also came with a uh, burn fire blaze or you know, burn phoenix. It's a nice hefty, it's usually a nice hefty um, metal wheel, like the 
earth wheel and I think the rock wheel is a little bit heavier and this especially like uh, and of course the basalt wheel is like the heaviest wheel overall uh, nice burn wheel uh, nice rounded evenly distributes the weight of the bay with a nice little sun looking feature in the middle <clears throat> like I said overall nice stamina bay or it's not nice stamina yeah um, yeah, enough of that. Next up, we have the SW145W, uh, no, S <laughs> getting ahead of myself, but yeah, the Switch 105 track. I'm thinking right now it's in attack mode because of the two claws, I think, the pointed edge. But yeah, you can actually flip that over. Which way, which way do you push it? Yeah, flip it over upside down. So, into I'm guessing this is defense. Wait. Yeah, I think this is defensive mode. Not bad. Or you can just like take it off overall, make use it as a standard one for five track. But I actually think it's actually slider like this. So I'm actually uh, so it's probably more recommended actually keep this on. It's also a nice reddish color that matches the face bolt and. Um, clear wheel. I'm, I'm mad about this wheel. It's like it's just there. And last up, we have uh, the WD track or WD tip. Um, excuse me. Yeah, WD tip, which is surprisingly a bright red or orangish color. <coughs> um. The the WT D the the WD tip is like one of the most common tips out there, and it's really decent actually. Has, um, yeah, it's like one of the de more decent tips out there for it being quite common. Once it like loses stamina, like it can actually rock back and forth and catch itself for a little bit, so that's really nice. And yeah, let's get this one together too. And here we have a fully um, assembled Burn Wolf uh, SW145 WD. Looks like a really decent stamina bay with the um, with the, the Burn Wolf as a good stamina uh, yeah as stamina. Um, the SW track for attack and defense combos. And um, the WD tip is just an overall decent tip. So yeah, it's a really good. This looks like a really decent bay in my opinion. So <coughs> yeah. And uh, overall, I recommend this this two pack because I didn't have either bay before, so now I do. Uh. I got this one. I forgot this. I forgot to say that I got this from Walmart for like seventeen bucks, which is a decent price for two bays. Um, so that's it for today's video, guys. Um, uh, it's not one of my better reviews, actually. So you guys can actually leave a thumbs down if you want, but whatever. Uh, it's all good. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to click the annotations around the screen or in the descriptions below. Um. For my other videos and I'll see you guys next time.